Hey, did you know? I used to be in therapy because of my voice. My doctor growing up once took a good look down my throat and said, you have a small voice box and you were born with a soft voice. That explained my whole life, why I couldn't really speak up or be loud, and why I'd lose my voice all the time. This actually took a toll on my self-esteem when I was 24. So my therapist used to give me homework every week, so I'd try not to spiral thinking, oh my god, I'm boring, or this person doesn't like me, whenever someone would say, what was that? Or worst case, I can't hear you. I did get better because of the therapy and also because some of my good friends who pretended like they could hear me loud and clear when actually at times they were holding their breath to listen to what I was saying. Anyway, sometimes I still have to fight that tinge of insecurity whenever someone can't hear me. But isn't life funny? Now I make a living because of these voiceovers. By the way, this was a purple sweet potato creme brulee bake that didn't taste very good. I was gonna scrap the video but a lot of you wanted to see the imperfect side of my cooking so enjoy. Let me know what you would have done differently.